Hello, I'm Lizzie. I'm delighted to be here as part of the Cowley Road Carnival. I absolutely love this event. It's such a highlight. So many people together. And obviously, it's really sad for us not to all be together in person. But we're, we're still having a carnival and we have to make our own little carnivals at home and share what we're doing. So I'm bringing some origami as a beautiful way of bringing a little bit of focus, looking after your well-being and also being a bit creative and having a bit of fun. It's for all ages. I'm going to share how to make a traditional origami heart, which is a beautiful thing to make. It's quite simple, actually, and really encouraging people to make something beautiful, add some colour and then maybe put up in your windows. Show your love, show your care. Also this year, thinking about how we are how Cali Road is such a lovely multicultural area, so many people and so many different backgrounds and that's something we really celebrate at the carnival. So although it feels like our horizons have shrunk, it's quite exciting this year, made contact with um, an origamist who's in Nigeria, Oluwatobi Sodomu, and he's somebody who um, seems to be doing exactly the same kind of thing as I am encouraging people to do origami so many smiles so much beautiful artwork and encouraging people to color it in so he's made a special film it's um Nigeria and you can see him and his world which would be really amazing and so we can be together it's also of course supporting um, Black Lives Matter too so we're celebrating each other that we are one people and that we should care about everybody of course so that's what a carnival is all about I'm going to show you how to make your very own heart and I hope you're going to decorate it at the end so I'm going to show you just a plain A4 piece of paper or whatever paper you've got will all work you don't need special paper for origami so I'm going to show you first of all how to make a square so this workshop is actually part of a bigger project I'm doing things like street parties supported by the lottery huge thanks to them um, and so there'll be lots of things hopefully happening in the area so I'm going to take a corner and bring it over but it'd be wonderful if you could start putting hearts in your windows show that care i know there's been lots of beautiful wind well, lots of beautiful rainbows from children but what about adults we can do things too so what i've done is i've taken the side and i brought it over and i've kept it all nice and lined up be really careful with origami take your time and then giving good strong folds and it's the folds that give it the strength it also lets out a little bit of bit of tension as well which is always good right on next i'm going to get rid of this rectangle so if you turn your paper over and then pull it back it's almost a bit like a robin hood's hat there we go and then again a good strong fold so if you've given it a good strong fold you should even be able to just tear it so you don't even need scissors no special equipment required so i'm going to do a little tiny rip and I do recommend putting it down on a hard surface. You can get that off. There we go. So our next step, we're also going to do another diagonal, but not all the way across. We're just going to do it as a pinch. So I'm folding it over and I'm simply pinching the middle. And that's just so that you get a halfway point. I will bring this up now that's it so hopefully it's looking like this our next step is to take the top and fold it down and again take your time we're aiming for precision here as part of the satisfaction of our recovery and if you find that you don't naturally do that well that's exactly why it's a good thing to do so this wasn't something i naturally did i was asked in a hospital by a patient to learn origami and pass it on and I felt I, I have to if someone's asking me to learn I should do it and it made my head hurt a little bit at first but I soon found it's such a wonderful thing to do and the more you do it the more relaxing you find it and it will make you and others smile so I brought that to the middle our next step is to take bottom and bring it up to the top keep it in the middle so the Cowley Road Carnival will be on social media. So if you can share pictures of what you've made, we'd so love to see. That would be amazing. So there we go. Keep it in a straight line. There we go. Right, the heart will start to emerge before your very eyes. So you're going to take it to the side and bring it up in a straight line. Hopefully the advantage of a video like this is you can always pause it, go back if you feel like, oh, I missed that bit. There we go. So I'm bringing it up 
and then the same on the other side bring it up in a straight line I hope you can check out beautiful origami in Nigeria as well lots of smiling faces and lots of really creative work too so like adding lots of color onto these things that's it so it looks a bit like a sort of a pixel heart at the moment you can soften it a bit so take the top and fold it down a little bit like so a little bit upside down there we go and then the same thing on the other side there we go and then we're going to soften the sides and again tucking it away we don't, don't want to see it do we don't want to see the little bit so there we go and that should be it it's a lovely lovely piece this a lovely heart so i hope you can write some messages on it really make it colorful i want to see what you're going to do with this so i look forward to seeing your work thank you very much <laughs>